Oh, that's and awesome. So Everyone listen up. We got two minutes of the show. It's our first show. Let's have a good one. Break. Hey, executives. How you doing? Uh, hey. Hey. Um, we're kind of hosting right now. You want to hear us practice? We messed up. Ah, do it again. Don't even look at How you doing? First show. We're, we're fine. We're trying to prepare for this. Relax. Sorry. This, this show. <laughs> well, but great. That's great. This is the first show. Yeah, no, it's okay. We got this. College yeah. news, easy, yeah, bro. Yeah, we're, we got yeah, this. Yeah, yeah. Definitely, it's definitely. gonna be good. It's gonna be good. Yeah. Yeah, just breathe. In and out. Yeah. Yeah, no. We yeah, no, got news. this. College news. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So you press this button, right? Yeah, yeah that okay, turns yeah. it on. Okay. And if you want to see the shot, you look at this. Okay, great. And then the prompter says, oh, so Yeah, I have a question uh, too. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Okay, so is it framed correct, you think? Because you can kind um, of see that? I think you should move it down just like. Okay. Like, oh, I see. Okay. That's about right. Okay. Okay, okay. cool. Thank you. This is my Guys, we're on this right now. What time is it? Oh, oh shoot, we gotta, gotta go. go! When I say K, you say C. C. When I say A, you <laughs> say B. K. C. Undercover! Let's go, let's go! Oh! <laughs> Sound check, sound check. No, we did, we did, we did. Yeah, Five, four, three, two. Good morning, Cavs. My name is Mira. And I'm Reese. Welcome to the first, first show of the year. You excited for this upcoming school year? Simply over the moon. How are you feeling? Pretty solid. I'm psyched to be a senior. Ready for the nursing home? Wrong senior. Oh, man. I always get confused. Probably why I'm not allowed to most retirement centers. So what I'm hearing is you need some more education on seniors. Someone to teach you about everything currently happening? You don't mean. I do. It's just that the prophecy foretold. Let's go to senior news. Yo Cavs, I'm Manny. And it's Andrew. And, and we're your senior, senior news. news. Any seniors still uncertain about which college has your name on it? Yeah, my friend was just wondering where to look. Well, the land is getting a shipment of college representatives coming to inform you on what they have to offer. Oh yeah, I've heard that McAllister College is sending a representative to the land next Wednesday on October 11th. And St. John Mullenberg College will also be here on the 12th for period one and two. Stop by Mrs. Durrell's room or the college office to get more information. Seniors, your 2024 package is going to be around $350. Hey Andrew, this package is gonna include a yearbook, a senior sweatshirt, t-shirt, also a breakfast or a talent show. Your order will be between October 16th and the 20th. Really? Man, I wish I was a senior this year. And lastly, Senior Super Relative Nomination slash Favorites are coming up. They open October 23rd and close the 27th. And for more information, check the Instagram account at Cavaliers2024. That's all for your senior news. And now back to your hosts. So, how's it feel to be back again? I'm having a blast. Reese, do you remember what it was like being a freshman? Sure, it was adorable. I was so young and filled with hope. It was just me and the bag of cement mix I brought to school every day. What? I named it Marcus. He was my dearest friend. Well, but before the accident. Someone poured water on Marcus. Oh. Yeah, I was really sad. It cemented in my memory. Did you have to send him to a cementary? Okay, we're done. How was your freshman year? Pretty good, honestly. I was class in 1976, and I was very excited. Wait, 1970? How, how old are you? But I do wish someone would give me some advice back then. Luckily for these new cuties, we have the perfect question of the week for them. Okay. Bruh. Hi Cavs, welcome to our first question of the week, and this week's question is, what's some advice you have for freshman students? What was the question? Bruh. <laughs> advice you have for new students? Oh, don't procrastinate. Do your homework. Don't get behind. 
Don't be late. Don't procrastinate. <laughs> Don't do it. Yeah, just okay. <laughs> stay organized. Nothing's that serious. Like, just take a deep breath and I promise it's not that big of a deal. I don't know, be confident, talk to people. You got this. I would say join your student council and participate in like the activities because you don't want to pay a lot for prom. Get to know people, have a routine. Like, just like, if you're going to do homework, do it first before you goof around and procrastinate. That's good advice. That's good advice. I mean, don't, don't fight, yeah, no fight. <laughs> no fighting, stay, stay in class, you know. Be, be on time. Be on that, time that's pretty much it. Yeah. Cool, you can walk around like you can Be nice. That's all for question of week. Now back to your host. That was actually so informative. I feel my brain rapidly wrinkling right now. Yeah, my brain just went from like smooth to like slightly pruney. It's like a grape left outside. You know, I had the weirdest dream last night. Tell me about it. I had a dream we went to college news. Like, like this college news? Right here, right now. That's really spooky, man. You know, I actually once heard a theory that dreams can predict the future. Which would mean, time for college news. <laughs> Good morning, Cavs. It's Makana. And Sebastian. Here, here with, with college, college news. news. Wait, why are you even on college news? You're not a senior. I don't know. They kind of just put me on here. Oh, OK. I mean, it's never too early to start thinking about college. Seniors, if you haven't already, start working on your college applications and pick up your updated transcripts in the college office located in I-126. Which applications are open now? UC, Common App, and CSU applications are open. Are you going to apply to UC, Common App, and CSU? Mm, I don't know, because that's going to cost a lot, and I don't have motion like that. Wait, Makana, you know you can apply for scholarships, which is free money, right? Wait, what? Where can I find them? You can find so many scholarships under Ms. Terrell's Class of 2024 College Information Updates on Schoology. Oh my god, thanks Sebastian. Well, I think that's all we have for college news. Now, now back, back to, to your, your house. house. Mira, you said you get to go to homecoming? Yes, it is literally my favorite event of the year. Really? Even better than Coachella? Duh, and there's going to be so many fun games and prizes to win. I'm so excited. I'm kind of nervous. Oh, wait, why? How come? I just don't want to like mess up, break any rules, or make people like annoyed or anything. Well, you do that every day. What difference does it make if you do it at homecoming? Wow, OK, that was really rude. I don't appreciate that at all. You know I'm kidding. But we have a PSA for rules and norms for the homecoming dance. Hello, Cavaliers. We're having a PSA of guidelines for your big day at home. Dress accordingly. Ticket, please. What are you wearing? You can't wear that. Sorry, I'm wearing something underneath. You can't wear that either. Damn. Don't bully. <laughs> you look stupid. What did you say? I said you look stupid. Your mom's stupid. Well, you. 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 Me. Do not splash water into the crowd. No violence whatsoever. Did you just get water on my friend? <laughs> oh, I'm drinking water and me Karen at home, Kobe. And most importantly, don't forget to have fun. Reese, do you know where you want to go to college? Not really. You have any suggestions? Probably somewhere with a good football program for you. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> you, you think so? <laughs> I know talent when I see it. Don't forget, I was a recruiter for UCLA football back in 1958. How old are you? All I'm saying is I know my way around a speakeasy. But regardless, I think you have some talent for sports. I don't know. I don't really know anything about sports. Like, wh what's the ball? Don't worry about it, because right now we got something that will increase your knowledge triple fold. That's my favorite number of folds. On to sports news. What's up, Cavs? It's Liz. And V. With your sports news. news. Last week, football beat Ta 40 to 28. Keep that energy up for today's homecoming game against Granada. We have a game against Granada, Steve? Yeah, make sure not to wear green. Where do I get tickets? You can get tickets at gofan.co for only $7. Only seven? Yeah. To anyway, we're going against Granada again on Monday in for volleyball in the small gym. Enough about Granada. I can already feel myself turning green like I'm about to steal Christmas. Tell me something else. OK, well, JV Girls Cross Country won third place overall last week at Griffith Park. Do you think if I did that, I could successfully run away from my problems? Knowing you, you'd probably trip over the finish line into another one. OK, B, you don't want to call me out. We're literally live. My bad. That's all we have for you this week, Cavs. Now let's check out our girls' varsity volleyball game from last week. Okay, 
Cleveland's been fantastic. The girls are extremely welcoming. We have such a good boys program that's supportive. It's really been a fantastic start so far. So looking forward to see how we can uh, pick the season up in the second half. So what first got you guys into volleyball? So my friends first introduced me in school actually. They showed me clips of them playing and I was like, oh I like, really like that and I wanted to try it out. I also started to become friends. Oh, um, I started because my brother, um, I wanted to like follow in his footsteps because he always inspired me. Playing volleyball at Cleveland has really helped me find a community. It's a great opportunity to just get out there and meet new people and have like school spirit. You think this year you're going to play another sport? How could I? I literally already play all of them. You are the best quarterback, point guard, and third baseman, but this year should be about trying new things. Hmm, how about we do something like fun and new on air? Want to play Mad Libs? You know it. Okay, okay, turn for group people. Let's. Verb. Go. Your favorite number. Two. N turn for a medieval weapon. Club. Where the rhymes to choose. News. So if we read that back, it's let's go to club news. Wait, wait, hold, hold on a minute. What's up, Cavs? It's Rochelle. And Liel. Oh my god, that rhymes. Yeah, anyways, keep the direct club news. Wait, wasn't your hair a different you color? Yeah, I messed what up. I, I, I had to, to fix it. In. Anyways, Club Rush was crazy. It, re it reintroduced many assortments of activities for everyone. I don't know what to say. I didn't rush to Club Rush. <laughs> Get it? Hashtag LOL. You didn't go to Club Rush? I just didn't have the time. But you missed out on so many clubs. I guess the party went out without me. What were some of the clubs there? Well, for starters, we had Cinema Club. Oh, I know that club. It's in C4 on Fridays during lunch. That's right. You know what's also on C4 at lunch, but on Mondays? The Kazoo Club. The room is open to all who want to tune on your very own instrument. I used to have an instrument. Are you still mad about that? I am. But is that why you have such an attitude with me right now? Yes, you literally sat on my ukulele. Well, I, I, I hear you, and I'm sorry. I got you a new one, though. Oh my god, yay! And I can play this at Ukulele Club. True. Ukulele Club is in room A2 on Thursdays after school. Play it. Oh. Oh, it, it, it's a oh, little out of tune. Well, well, why are other clubs you can give a shout out to Leo? Well, there's Key Club, Taylor Swift Club, all the student unions, all the student councils, Plant Pals, and many, many more options to choose from. You can see all the clubs listed on our Cleveland website with their information. Well, Rochelle, it's been swell. Well, see you later, Cavs. Let's head over back to our host. Now that I think about it, Club Rush was super short. Two days is not enough to show off all the amazing clubs we have here at the land. Yeah, Club Rush is like me in the morning, always in a rush. <laughs> so you're saying that you're sometimes late? And stay with me here. When you're late, you move too fast, and maybe you break things. I'm late and breaking things? You know what that reminds me of? Late I'm breaking! breaking. Good morning, Caps. I'm Izzy, and welcome to the first show of the year. There's many more to come, and I'm excited to be back. I know we missed each other. Now, I don't have a lot of late-breaking news, so I will make it quick. Homecoming is officially tomorrow, and I can't wait to see you all there. But in order for me to see you there, there are a couple rules and steps. Make sure, make sure, 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 sure. This is me emphasizing the fact that you need your school IDs to get into the land of cards, because you never know you could be pretending to be someone else. Identity fraud is a real thing. So make sure you bring your ID so you can get your party on. Also, dress code, one of the most important things. Ladies, nothing too short and showy. I know all of you want to look cute, but you can still look cute with restrictions. And boys, no sagging, because as much as you think we want to see it, we really don't, so pull your pants up. And no throwing water around and wetting each other or pushing each other. We don't want to get HOCO shut down, and we definitely do not want your school events taken away. Also, we have received new books in the library, so make sure you check them out. Because a little birdie told me that at some schools there are banned books, like not allowed. So when you get the chance, stop by the library. Tomorrow is the last day. And that is all I have for you today. I can't wait to see you all at HOCO tomorrow. Now, back to your host. So, we're the new executives for KCAV this year. How do you feel? Honestly, I feel pretty good. How about you? Ah, I'm excited. I can feel this year is going to slap. I have so many ideas for shows. Like? Sock puppets. What does that even mean? In your heart of hearts? You know. Whatever you say, bro. But you know what I'm excited for this year? My birthday! Aw, you look a day over 98! I really think so. But on the topic of birthdays, let's do birthday shoutouts. Happy birthday to Christina and happy birthday to Dave from David. Happy birthday to Matthew and happy birthday to Miss Waba from Taylor Swift Club. Happy birthday to Davey and happy birthday to, to Diana. 
I had so much fun hosting this show. Hey, it's only the first show. There will always be new beginnings somewhere. See you all next time. Same time. Same place. Here with your Casey, Avi, KCAP, KCAP News. News.